back. So today I'm quite excited because I'm starting to get into that autumn kind of wintry mood and it's the first day that I am wearing some dark lipstick and it's just got me really really excited to get into autumn and have hot chocolates and yes so what I thought I would do is I would show you some of the autumn wintry style clothes that I have bought from random places. It's not from Primark, there's some uh, New Look, Forever 21, uh, River Island and I just thought I would share with you some of the pieces that I've bought lately because it's all autumny stuff and I'm really excited to show you guys. So if you're interested then keep watching. So what I've done, I've actually popped them on hangers to show you for this because I bought a lot of this stuff online. I thought it would just be quite nice to show you on a hanger what something looks like because I haven't all got them in bags or anything. And the first um, item that I have bought, which is from Forever 21, and this was £22, is this really, really chunky sort of cable knit um, sweater, jumper in cream it's quite long and it is really really wide now this is in the size this is in size small and it's kind of like a jumper dress so i really really like this and my idea with wanting to wear something like this would be with some boots and stuff that i will show you a nice floppy hat um some tights or something and then going out for a meal in the winter i just thought would look really really lovely and 22 pounds isn't too bad either because it is very very thick and it doesn't feel too itchy either which is always a bonus Next is something from New Look, and this was eight ninety nine, and this is just a black ribbed. You can't, you probably can't really see that it's ribbed. Uh, kind of the cut out shoulder, long sleeve top, and it was only eight ninety nine, like I said. And I just really, really like this. It's something quite simple. I quite like the ribbed stuff, whereas I really went off anything ribbed for quite a long time, and I'm, I mean, like years, I've gone off anything ribbed. And then I've seen it in the shops quite a lot, so I thought I would try it on, and I did really, really like this. Next is something from River Island, and I don't normally go into River Island, but I needed to pick up some stuff for work, some new sort of workwear, and I thought I would just have a look in there. I didn't really find anything for work in there, apart from this top, which I would wear at work and in my personal life as well. But again, it's just another one of these ribbed tops, but it is a roll neck. But what I really like about the roll neck on this one is that it's so it's really really thick so it doesn't feel too thin some of those ones that are in Primark at the moment the material feels so thin and I just I don't feel very good in it when I try them on so this one I really really like it's the long sleeves just nice and long and the material of it's really thick it was quite expensive it was 18 pounds which I think is way too much money for um, a ribbed top like this especially when you can pick them up for sort of eight pounds or so in Primark but I really wanted something that felt really good quality and had a really, really good thick neck on it as well. So I really like this. Next from New Look is this kind of like knitted waistcoat with this waterfall effect just down the front. And it's in uh, black and white, so it creates that kind of grey effect. And it's got just sort of an as techy print on this. Now, for some reason, I've cut the tag off this. I haven't worn it, but I've cut the tag off of it. So I can't remember how much it was, but I think it was about 20 to 22 pounds, something like that. I will link it down below for you guys if I can still find it online. But it is quite long. It comes below the bum, which is quite nice if you're wearing it with leggings or something. But I really, really like this. And I did think it was quite expensive for what it was. But I just thought if you've got like a, a nice long sleeve white top or a black top underneath with some either some ripped jeans or some leggings or something, it would just look really, really nice just to layer it over really. So, got that. And another thing that I've got here, I've bought a lot of like tops and cardigans and that kind of stuff really. And it's from Forever 21. And it is really, 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 really long. It's a super long cardigan. It doesn't have any buttons or anything because I don't like buttons. So I really like the fact that it doesn't have that. It's this kind of grey marle effect as well. It feels really, really nice. It's a really nice sort of stretchy material, but it feels quite thick and I kind of, this is just a really nice casual kind of throw over. So I absolutely love this. It comes well below the knees. It's sort of, but above calf length. So it's in between your ankles and your knees. It's that, it is really, really long. It was 14 pounds. I got it in a size small as well. But what I do like is that it has pockets. So I think that's pretty cool. But you can't see them on the front. It's quite hard to show you actually. Um, but it's like built into the side of it. 
you can see the pocket in there. So from the front you wouldn't think there was a pocket and then you can just pop your hand in. Um, so yeah, I really, really like this. And I've wanted a long cardigan for a couple of sort of autumns now. And I never really get one and I wish I had. And then this time I finally got one. Next from New Look is actually a pair of skinny ripped jeans. Now these were £24.99 reduced down to £10 which I think is amazing. And they're just this really really dark blue and they've just got one basic slit in um, each knee. So they're not um, like super ripped or anything. But I really liked these and for a tenner I thought it was amazing. £24.99 down to £10. I picked these up online as well. And the idea of what I thought I could do with this is wear it with the black um, top that hasn't got the shoulders on it and wear it with some nice boots and I just think that would look a really really nice outfit so they've just got the plain pockets on the back they're quite stretchy as well it's quite a stretchy fabric and they are just part of the skinny range they just called them the authentic stretch skinny range so for a tenner I thought it was an absolute bargain because I wouldn't pay £24.99 for them. I'd probably just go and buy a pair of jeans in Primark for like a tenner and then just cut them myself, but for £10 and they're already done. Perfect. Then I've gone and bought another pair of boots and you guys might have seen this because I've already posted a picture of these on my Instagram, but I love them so, so much. I absolutely love them. I've bought so many boots already this year. Um, for autumn and winter and I think I started back in the summer I got a pair of boots from Just Fab but I saw these online and fell in love with them and they are so unbelievably comfortable I have already worn them twice but they are just these um, chunky black ankle boots it's about a three and a half maybe pushing four inch heel uh, like I said I'll link them down below for you guys if they've still got them online so you can see what the heel height is. There is about a centimetre, just over a centimetre high sort of platform there. They've got a zip just on the inside and I just love them. They're so comfortable and I get, I've already had quite a few compliments as well from people saying, well, aren't they lovely boots? Then the last thing that I got is a really, really lovely black floppy hat. This was from H&M. I've pulled the ticket off this as well, but it was from H&M and I think it was about 14 99 something like that. It's just a cotton, nice floppy hat, and I've always wanted to wear a floppy hat, but I've never really felt very confident to do it, but I think so many people are wearing hats now, and I had my nice pink fedora that I got back in the summer, and I did wear that a few times, and I really, really liked it, but I've always wanted a nice, really big winter floppy hat, so um, I'll probably wear this in a lookbook as well, because if you're not really sure how to wear them, or where to wear them as well, because that can be quite hard to know when to wear hats, then I will include this in a lookbook as well for you guys. That is everything that I've bought from a few different stores lately over the past sort of month and a half, so some about a month or so. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. I will have everything linked down below for you guys. And let me know if you do want me to do a sort of autumn winter lookbook, because I'll have to get down to help me come and film it. But yeah, I hope you guys are having a really great day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys.